out in Holderman County. We're at Larry Powell's farm. Larry breeds a beautiful uh, black Angus for us. Fantastic genetics. And as you can see, as these heifers, he's just, just given birth to, uh, I think there's probably about 20 or so, 25 at least, I'd say, of the little blacks, which uh, they're cute little buggers. They're only about uh, two weeks old, I'd say. And um, yeah, these other, the other red ones actually, he's an he's a, a all black Angus herb. The other red ones are actually a rare heritage German breed. Uh, they're not. They're the only ones that aren't blacks. But his main herd is black Angus. This is just a small part of it. And uh, we have his at the moment in the shops. At the moment, actually, we have his uh, stuff from last year. The stuff that was born last year. Um, but yeah, great, incredible genetics. Really, really good stuff. Beautiful, nice small eye. Very little fat cap. And small eye, really nice marble. As you can see, noisy buggers too. Probably a mom who doesn't want me to get too close to her calf. So we're out in uh, Jarvis, Ontario. We're in Holderman County. Uh, this is we're on George Miller's farm. George Miller is uh, one of our special breeders who raises for us. But uh, one thing George does is he, he raises he raises a bit of everything for us. He raises some British breeds. He raises some Angus and some Hereford for us, as well as some Belted Galloways as well. But he, he's he's most well known for, and he's actually internationally renowned for his purebred Charlais, uh, which as you can see behind us, and Charlais is the classic French breed. And uh, we, you know, I love the Charlais, but I like them even better when you cross them on a black Angus, they get absolutely amazing. So every year George will take his Charlais bull and he'll put it on a herd of black Angus for us, and we get what's called a smoky calf, which is a half black and a half, uh, half Charlais. And uh, they turn out absolutely amazing. They get that you know, beautiful, nice bone structure of the Charlais, and they get the lovely marbling of an Angus. So we've got a great, a bit off the distance before, we've got a great close up shot of them. And you can see pure Charlais. And it, like I always say, if you've ever had a great steak in a French restaurant, uh, this, chances are it's come from a Charlais. Okay, so we're out at Murray Connings, our provincial abattoir in uh, Norfolk. And uh, we've got two of our local farmers here in Norfolk, uh, George Miller and Larry Powell, with custom raised Angus for us. This is, this is from the verses in the Cumbrian body. This is from George Miller. George has a separate pen, which is called the Cumbrian pen, and he separates all the animals off, the ones that are especially for us and are raised for us. Uh, beautiful stuff. We have our own special feeding program with George. He does an absolute amazing job raising cattle for us all year round. I'd like to show you down here, there's a couple more bodies from Larry Powell. We take you to Larry Powell's farm. He has a pure red Angus farm. And I'll show you some of his stuff. Bodies back here are, uh, are from, from Larry, from Larry Powell. Is that one over there? from George Miller. These ones from Larry Powell. Beautiful bodies. You see that? Pure, pure Angus. Lovely, marbling. Nice marbling in the eye. Uh, not too much uh, back fat on them, but really great genetics. You get an absolutely fantastic finished product. Nice size too, nice little small bodies. That's the pure British breed in them, the fact that they're pure Angus and uh, make absolutely good for you.